Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to the tavern. We're back at it, giving another brand new review just for you guys. Athletic Brewing Run Wild IPA. We're going to run with this one, guys. We bought these the other day. And at Athletic Brewing Company, we are pioneering a craft brew revolution. We believe you shouldn't have to sacrifice your ability to be the best and to enjoy, and enjoy great brews. So we created an innovative lineup of refreshing non-alcoholic craft brews. We... To my knowledge, have tried all the ones that you can buy. This is the last one that I've seen, and I really wanted to do it so we can kind of complete the whole saga, right? So, Run Wild IPA, let's see how it is. If you've seen yesterday's short, you kind of got a, a little advantage over everybody. You kind of got to see me try it firsthand there. But the color is really beautiful. Look at that. It's kind of peachy, slight orange in there, kind of honey. It smells really nice. It's got a real, uh, like, faint grapefruit, coffee. It smells like my candle we got. Um, it's kind of like a, a real faint, uh, almost like a, like a, almost, I want to say a berry. Like, I'm getting like a berry smell for some reason, but seriously. That one's really good. So, what I really get from this one is that it kind of really resembles a true IPA, the not not the non-alcoholic versions, where they're kind of really mild or lackluster. This one's full flavored. It tastes 100% like an IPA, and probably one of my favorites from their entire selection that we've tried. Now, my friend that's doing this with me, he liked the um, the Cerveza one. The light copper was his favorite, but I'm gonna have to go out on a limb here and say this one is my most favorite one out of all this. Um, granted, <clears throat> it does have a weird, weird buildup at the end. It's kind of like right around the back of the nodes, but it's not bad. It leaves a lingering taste afterwards too that kind of coats the whole palate. And it doesn't just cleanse and go away. And I really do enjoy that in a drink that kind of really develops as you drink it and builds across the whole palate. Instead of you drinking it and then it's gone. And you're like, wow, now i got to drink again because you want that taste sensation back. This is one of those drinks that kind of gives you a feeling of the flavor continuously and longer across the whole palate and the entire experience of the drink. Which I think is absolutely amazing. But really good. Athletic Brewing, you guys have helped me get through halfway of our sober June. And I appreciate you guys so much for making quality brews for non-alcoholic times. And like you said on the can, you're trying to make something where you can enjoy it and still be at your best and not have to be drunk all the time. But hey, I get it. I love it. Sober June's going great. And I can't wait for July, though, guys, to pick up some more reviews. So remember, I'm Justin. Welcome to the tavern. I buy it so you guys don't have to. I try it so you guys don't have to. All of these athletic brewings, I bought them a six pack each at about nine dollars a k. Nine bucks, nine bucks a six pack. So, go give them a try. Tell me what you think in the comments below, guys. We got a new foam. <coughs> we cut the beard off today. Trimmed it up a little bit. So many new things. I can't wait to explain them all, to express them all to you guys. So hit the like button, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Another brand new. We're gonna try to stream a little bit. We're gonna see how it goes. But if not, you guys catch another new review tomorrow as well. So I love you guys, and I can't wait to see you on the next video.